Circus Maximus was a massive arena that accommodated 250,000 people. One time the games ran out of criminals and up next were the lions, Caligula's favorite. He ordered his guards to drag the first five rows of spectators into the arena. These hundreds of people were all devoured for his amusement. Caligula attempted to instate his favorite horse, Incatitis, as a priest and consul, and ordered a beautiful marble stable to be built for him, complete with chairs and couches which Incatitis never sat on. Caligula waged war on the god of the sea, Poseidon. He ordered his army to throw their spears into the water and declared defeat of the god by collecting seashells and riding into Rome claiming his defeat. Diocletian reigned at the end of the crisis of the 3rd century, and though he significantly stabilized and improved the empire's military and economy, he will forever be remembered as the worst persecutor of Christians in history. Diocletian issued several edicts in 303, removing all rights from Christians until they converted to the Roman religion. The Christians refused, and from 1303 to 1311, at least 3,000 Christians were martyred. Christian churches were sought all over the empire and burned to the ground. When the persecution did not seem to be working, the Christians simply went into hiding and continued to spread their religion. Diocletian advocated their torturous and entertaining executions in the Circus Maximus and Colosseum. This was the time when most Christians were thrown to the lions, much to the delight of the Roman citizens who worshipped Roman gods. Nero never trusted his mother and tried to kill her by having her ship sunk. When that didn't work, he ordered her execution. Nero reigned for 15 years, and during that time he was accused of treason in the beginning of 62. He executed several dozen of his accusers. In 64, the Great Fire of Rome burned down the city. The city wanted a scapegoat, so Nero blamed the fire on the Christians, and they were terribly persecuted. He had many arrested, impaled, and burned to death as torches to light in his garden.